I'm Ronnie Hillman, running back, Denver Broncos, representing Mile High Report. Welcome back to SB Nation. I'm Amy K. Nelson, and joining me right now is new Denver Broncos running back, Ronnie Hillman. When you got the call and you found out that you were going to be a Denver Bronco, what was the first thing that ran through your mind? I was just surprised because you know, I had no contact with him at all besides you know, the confirmation number to call on draft day and you know, at, the, at the combine. So I was just like, wow. So I was like, you know, hopefully they're not playing with me. So you know, I, was just, I was just like kind of hesitant, like, all right, let's see what they're talking about. Excited? Oh yeah, I was excited. I was just like, you know, I don't want to get too excited first and then they'd be like, you know, we're thinking about getting you. So I was like, I was just trying to listen and see what they were going to say first. Okay, so what do you know about the city of Denver? The city of Denver is cold in the winter. <laughs> but I mean, I've been hearing it's a fun place to be. So I mean, I haven't really been there too long. So I haven't really got the chance to really see Denver. So but you're a Cali guy. So you're going to be all right? You're going to be able to adjust? Yeah, I think I'll be. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> you might have to be able to come home as much as you can. Yeah, I'll probably be home in the off season, trying to get away from the you know, right. snow. What is it that you're most looking forward to in joining the Broncos? Just being able to help, just trying to play and trying to be productive and you know, playing with pain playing man is always a plus too. So. It's going to be exciting, right? Yeah, it's really exciting. You know, you're a Hall of Fame quarterback, so you know you never get to learn from him. And then you get to learn from the team of uh, Willis McGahee, so it's, it's a pretty good situation. Obviously, the college game and the pro game, they're different. What do you think is going to be an adjustment for you? Um, probably just the terminology, just picking up everything as far as, as far as the plays and stuff. Other than that, I mean, I'm pretty sure I'll be fine with the speed and everything. Just trying to, you know, learn actually how to, you know, play fast and you know, be able to read everything faster. So one thing that I think maybe not everyone knows about you that I think makes you a little special, a little bit different than most, is that you were once coached by Snoop. Is that true? <laughs> yeah, it's true. <laughs> All right. So what's he like as a coach? <laughs> well, he used to play in high school, so you know, I think he, I mean, he was he grew up a, a, a real big football fan. So, but I mean, he's been doing it for a while, even before I played, and you know, he he uh, represented the team, and we had coaches that actually you know coach and stuff. But I mean, it was a pretty good situation. I was in at that time. You're on Twitter, right? And I think you might have my favorite name for a Twitter handle. Tell me how you came up with it. Uh, Mr. Hillman to you. Um, I mean, I was just... I was just thinking of a name, and then I was just like, you know, and then there was the college. My team's always teasing me because you know I was, you know, I used to just I was the vocal one and everything. So every time you know I talked, they'd be like, oh, that's Mr. Hillman to you instead of you know, Ronnie. So I was just like Mr. Hillman, and then I just put the to you. And You're putting people on on notice. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you address him. It's Mr. Hillman to all of you. All right, Mr. Hillman. Well, thanks for joining us today. No Appreciate problem. it, and good luck in Denver. Thank you.